This is the first of four videos about how to retreat. Look at the length of the stride and the way the player moves back down the pitch. The player is always on their toes to have the best possible balance. When the player is up on their toes, the calf muscles are tightened, which prepares the body for quick movements. Compare for yourself how fast you feel with your foot flat on the ground and when you stand on your toes. What a difference! The player always has one foot on the ground. Even when the speed in the backward movement increases, there is always one foot there on the ground. When a player is in the air, they can no longer influence the direction of their own movement, so they always want to have some part of the feet, preferably the toes, on the ground. Look also at the length of the stride. Everyone is very short and the footwork is therefore very active. The shorter the stride, the easier it is to react to the opponent's movement. See how the player places the feet on the ground in relation to each other. The feet and legs don't cross. They also don't strike one another. Rather, they are right beside one another in every step without touching. Watch how deep the player bends the knees, how they lean the upper body forward and how they shift the balance from the front to the back with a low centre of gravity. Check out where they are looking, always at the ball and not at the opponent's chest or anywhere else. It's the ball that the defender is interested in. Tackling or putting the opponent off comes further down the list of priorities.